Hello everybody welcome back to my youtube channel friends in this video i'll be discussing the very much famous course onto the internet and one of the highest rated course for data analytics professionals which is ibm data analyst certification course so friends this is one of the most uh, popular course also onto the internet for the data analytics job profile so you, you can see these numbers onto my screen close to 60000 people have already enrolled into this program so friends i made a video the previous day onto the google data analytics certification program now it is kind of similar and it is being uh, also produced by the tech giant ibm so you can uh, definitely rely on onto the credibility of the program or they'll be teaching into this course but i'll be giving my honest reviews about this course into this video that might help you to make a better decision whether you should pursue this course or not or it is worth spending your time on to this course also i'll be discussing multiple factors whether this course is for uh, suited for the beginners level or somebody who is just starting out with data analytics or whether this particular course uh, makes you job ready uh, and also will this course will be providing or helping you into making a transition into the data analytics file or not and also at the end of the video i'll be providing some of the helpful tips so if you are thinking to pursue this course uh, better look at these tips which i'll be providing that might help you a lot and get out the most from this course and some of the alternatives to this course which you might consider and explore later on without wasting much time let's move to my screen and let get an overview of this particular course i am at the course at a portal for the ibm data analytics certification program now the very uh, first visualization which i get is and i like this very much is the they have provided a number here you can see 31% of the people who are pursuing this course they are able to make a successful transition into the data analytics profile now you buy a now you can just uh, think of like 100 people are pursuing 31 people out of them are making a transition into the data analytics profile so the success rate the success rate you cannot decide from this but this is a very good number which gives a perspective to you whether you should try to pursue this course or not now coming to the other uh, numbers here so this would take too close to around 11 months to complete but this is totally a self paced course and it is suggested pace from ibm is from about 3 hours per week and also this is available into multiple subtitles language along with english and this is from a beginner level perspective so you, they are teaching you everything from a beginner level only now getting some overview what they will be teaching so uh, you will be getting to demonstrate proficiency into using spreadsheets and utilizing excel to do to do all the data analysis into the excel tool so microsoft excel is one of the the recommended tools with the very first tool which you should definitely learn if you are willing to make a transition to the data analyst profile the second thing is develop working knowledge of python Python and NumPy, Pandas, and other libraries which are present into the, into the Python programming language. So Python is a very much good language, and you should definitely learn this language. They'll be teaching this language uh, from very beginner level, and they'll be also teaching some visualization tools such as Cognos and Matplotlib into the Python. So Matplotlib is a module for doing all the data analysis and visualization in the form of bar graph and the other charts. and now coming to the other part and they'll be providing some jupiter notebooks so jupiter is a platform where you will be going and write the python code so they'll be providing all these everything sql python and the jupiter notebooks for you to make a easy uh, systematic study process now coming to the courses which they gonna teach here and uh, the very first courses they will just be introducing you to the data analytics uh, field and uh, about the big data platform also such as hadoop hive spark so this would get uh, give you a better perspective about how does a beginner level data analyst job looks like and they would be teaching uh, some amount of soft skills which you should have uh, for making a good data analyst and also the they will be introducing you, you to the concepts of data analyst into the very first course now coming to the second course and th this is completely based on the excel so excel is a tool which we use to do good amount of data analysis so i've discussed this into my data analyst road map video also now excel is a very good tool so they'll be teaching the whole of excel and how to how do data analyst 
perform analysis with the help of excel so they'll be teaching this into the course two their course number three is all about data visualization using cognos so you'll be having a data set now from that data set you'll be creating multiple pie charts bar graphs and you'll be using cognos to do that so this is data visualization course four so they are, will be teaching python so uh, python is programming language with uh, some important modules such as numpy pandas matplotlib they help you to make a good uh, analysis onto the data set so they'll be teaching python and uh, mind you python constitute around 50 percent of this course so amount the x hours they'll be teaching this course x by two hours would be devoted just to make you understand python from from a very beginner level perspective and that is the most uh, lovable part of, uh, for, for this particular course for me because they are teaching the programming language into much more detail and that is the most important part for any data analyst job profile and they would be also be giving some python projects for you to do so you are you have gained the knowledge into course 4 now into the course 5 you will be doing a project what is better than this now coming to course number 6 so they will be teaching database and sql now out of all the job descriptions which i have seen for the data analytics job profile sql is present in almost all the uh, job uh, profiles for data analysis so please uh, i would highly request you to uh, learn sql from a very uh, deep perspective very much uh, in a very much disciplined way now coming to course number seven so this is the data analysis with python so again you will be using python to import data set cleaning the data set they will be they will be making you prepare the data frame summarizing the, the data and they will be also be teaching some machine learning concepts such as regressions and data and building data pipelines so this is team pandas numpy scipy libraries and the other libraries so you see how amount big amount of knowledge they are providing into this course so i guess this is the best part of this course they are teaching python into very much deeper perspective so if you are beginner i would highly recommend you to take this course and um, here you have done all the data analysis now you should uh, now you have your data set ready so you should create data visualization here onto the data set so into the course eight they will be using python to uh, prepare the data visualization so no, earlier they will be teaching using the cognos now they are teaching using the python uh, the data visualization techniques and the best part of this course is uh, you have gained all the skills now you have a capstone project where you can demonstrate your skills to the recruiter so you are given an opportunity to get your own data set make your own analysis create your own visualization into the capstone project and it will be reviewed by the professionals here and they'll be mark marking you onto the analysis which you have done and the things which you have learned from this particular course this is the best part i like because you've learned these skills now you know how to apply them and uh, you'll be getting the marks the courses overview which they are teaching so you can see the instructors they are for some of them are the ibm professionals some of them are working at ibm as a data analyst data scientist let us move to some of the courses faq and do i need to take the course in a specific order professionals they are highly recommending you to take the courses into the specific order because i also feel like uh, the courses have been designed from from a very zero level to uh, the advanced level so you should definitely pursue this course into the systematic way now do you need to have your background knowledge of anything no it is not recommended either you can be from any degree you can pursue this course uh, it is just some high, high school level mathematics language that is uh, required for this course now what jobs you, you will be eligible uh, so this course is highly designed to make you job ready so what all job profiles you'll be working for so you'll be working for a date entry level data analyst role or a data scientist position or a data engineer position so friends these uh, this course opens gate to a lot of opportunities if you are thinking to pursue this course so i would like to give you some tips uh, while you are pursuing this course so the number one tip is uh, you are doing course number one so follow along the course like practice all, all the concepts and then go on uh, move on to the next concept so that would help you to retain all the concepts all the things which they the instructor have taught you and you would be able to retain and you will be sp able to speak into the interviews and that would make you job ready so friends i would highly recommend you following this particular procedure go into a systematic way the second number tip which i would really recommend you is do not just rely on to this course follow along all the materials which are available onto the internet for the data analytics job profile 
uh, follow some good YouTube channels, follow some blogs, get some good materials to learn Python and other kind of tools here, which they have mentioned that and that would increase a lot of your probability to make a transition into the data analytics uh, job profile. So alternatives which you can take uh, if you're not uh, willing to pursue this course and want to explore some other programs. So uh, this this Google data analytics certification course also. So I made a video on that. So you can go and check out that and explore those all courses also and i made a differences video like whether you should be pursuing the ibm data analytics certification course or the google and i've just compared them to multiple perspective so you can go and definitely check out all those videos you can also explore multiple youtube channels and also udemy there's some good amount of materials on to udemy also so friends, I hope you like this particular video. Please smash the like button and subscribe to my channel to receive some good amount of knowledge into the data analytics domain. Meet you in the next video. Till then, thank you so much. Bye.